hey guys how's it going what's happening um nice to be back again um i'm excited today because i am glad to announce that i'll be making my first trip for the year <laughs> i finally get to breathe in a different air i'm so glad i'm i mean if I'm looking forward to it so much that I'm putting so much energy into packing. Uh, yeah, and for the next three days, uh, up to the day I'll be leaving, uh, I'll just be taking as long as I pack, as I buy stuff, as I buy stuff, guys, because my account is literally screaming right now. I have a lot of things to buy. Now, I'm not buying because I have to buy. I'm buying because it's just like really necessary. Um, there are some items that I had finished and for some reason it wasn't so... I mean, I had like a plan B, so I didn't bother to replace. But in this case, I'm going to another country uh, and with a different weather condition. So it's just necessary to buy. So like replacing some of my skincare products, um, buying some thicker clothing, um, replacing some of my makeup stuff. I will not be doing makeup as much where I'm going to, but I mean, it's better to just have it and so on and so forth right you would get to see everything in this vlog um so yes we have the next three days together and it's going to be fun exciting i'm not going to say where i'm going to i want to leave you to guess i'm giving the clue the weather is cold it's not in nigeria so guess one where do you think i'm going to let me read in the comment section Right? All right so right now i'm going to the salon uh this is day one so i'm literally going to the salon now to braid my hair um and then uh that's all i'll be doing today and then there's tomorrow and there's the next day and then it's the day i leave so stay here subscribe comment like and let's you know let's let's do this together right okay It's really sunny outside, but I love it. My skin is skinning. So, um, quick outfit check. I loaded my hair two days ago, so I just put this band over it so it looks nice. Um, I'm wearing one of my big t-shirts and then a nice short maker and then yeah. Something comfortable. I have my laptop with me here. And then there's this really nice bag that uh, was given to me. At an event it has my name on it i love the bag so much i spoke at an event and there was what was given to me in the gift box with, amongst other things so yeah we're ready to go let's go let's go and be fine let's go and make me hair i'm making a quick stop at burger king i'm definitely going to be at that salon for nothing less than five hours and i haven't had breakfast yet so i'll just get something something very small to eat just to hold my stomach right um yeah let's enter burger king <laughs> from chicken uh, burger king is where that i have only tried their chicken burger and their nuggets their nuggets are really nice uh and the, the chicken burger is the only thing i've tried they have other types of burgers but the chicken burger is the only thing i've tried anyways i'm on my way now to the salon my salon is in lucky face one as well so it's about um it's about well, driving like seven minutes from my house and I've been using them for I've been using them for like two years now um, yeah two years now they, they really know how to take care of my hair and that, that I think that's that's like key for any for anyone who wants to like make a choice of of salon yeah 
so i'm making braids um for my trip and it's not a decision that i'm making because you know it's not a one-off decision that's what i'm trying to say every time i travel i always make braids and to be honest i envy people that actually fix to travel or that they wear wigs on trips i really i don't know i mean i i like when they say they do it i don't think i can because i already feel like even in nigeria wearing wigs there's always a thing of me wanting to take it off <laughs> like can i just get home and yank this thing off so i'm always like okay this is how i am even in nigeria how much more when i'm not in the country do i really want to go through that uh stress of wanting to take off my wigs every time and because a lot of times when i travel the, i i mostly work with time it's like i have to be here at this time and guess what <laughs> i am a multitasker i know how to multitask and i have a lot of things that i am i do at the same time guys like so while i'm even doing work i'm also trying to create a reels or trying to work, put together something for my vlog so a lot of times it's me trying to do like three things at the same time so imagine i'm traveling and i have to leave my house or leave the hotel at nine o'clock you can bet that i'm up like seven to just ensure that i'm able to do everything i want to do within that two hours time frame that i have before i leave the, the hotel so imagine that be my case and then i'm still thinking of how to style my wig ah wigs let's not do that so i rather just do my braids that just allows me to i could just like even while walking or while rushing to the car or while i'm trying to leave the hotel i can just straighten out with my hand or i can just quickly tie it over my head you know that kind of thing so i've always done braids um i watched a vlog one time by dima dima ume yeah that's her name and you know she traveled with a sewing and it was nice because it was a straight hair so it wasn't so stressful i think all she probably had to do every morning was straighten out the front of her hair and that worked maybe that if i have to try anything different from braiding that would be what i'll try but till then i love my braids so i'm just a minute away from the uh salon yeah we're going to spend the rest of the day together um i don't think i have much to to vlog or i don't think i have much to to show from now maybe just me making my hair and me eating my burger king yeah just that all right guys i'm here already
I braided my hair for a little over two hours to say, or let's say, pata pata, almost three hours. And yeah, I'm done. Simple braids, straight, nothing too serious. Uh, and that's it for the next one month or so because I carry my braids for a, a while. But yeah, it's time to go home and. I honestly don't know what I have planned for the rest of the day. When we watch a movie, eat and sleep. And whatever it is, is until tomorrow. It's day two. Uh, the energy is still high. <laughs> really high. Um, I trust you slept well. I trust you had an amazing night. Um, I slept late. I was watching a Korean movie. Uh, and the last episode it ended yesterday so I intentionally stayed up late to watch my bad right so today I don't have a lot to do today today I you know I said yesterday that I have some I have to get like some I have to get new products so new makeup products new skincare products and um, I have picked those up today um, and then uh, I think that's pretty much what I have to do like the major thing I have to do today I have meetings today as well so today will be me juggling with um, today will be me juggling trying to finish up my packing and also doing work stuff and today is a Monday so it's expected so I'll just be picking up the products and then I'll come back home to mentally put things together so like mentally um, tick off on have I put this aside have I put that aside have I brought this out so I don't forget anything and then uh, I will be packing fully fully tomorrow so tomorrow is like the day I pack and then close up my box um, a little birdie told me it's not even a little birdie I mean a little birdie told me but then I found out that um, my connecting location is crazily cold so right now I am really trying to get a winter jacket last minute i don't even know where to get from i'm sure i try and share but at the end of the day i might have to reach out to um i don't know i really don't know what i'm gonna do but i really hope i'm able to get a winter jacket today i'll let you know if i do <laughs> and if i don't god help me god help me because i don't know how i'm going to cope but yeah um i guess we'll talk soon i know I, I had said something about i know i had said something about picking up my makeup stuff and my um skincare products unfortunately i could not film that because uh, it was quite a rush they had called me and said they were closing early so i had to like rush down and trust me i didn't have that extra time to record the video but i didn't get a lot of things um I got <clears throat> for my makeup products I got uh, a new eye pencil uh, what else did I get I got um, uh, I got my fixing spray I got uh, a new beauty blender I got uh, I, it wasn't a lot on the makeup side but for my skincare products I just got a new um, I got a new um, my set my PM therapy PM uh, moisturizer I got um, I got this nice amazing soap <laughs> that I so this soap right I saw it on um, um, I saw it on Dima's vlog on one of Dima's vlog it's called the neem oil black soap and I, 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 I mean it, it looks nice I like the packaging I'm just gonna put the pictures on the screen here so you can see but it, very nice packaging and I can't wait to use it I'm sure you might want to be like ah, you just heard someone talk about the soap and you want to use it but guys that's not how it works um, I have a very good understanding of my skin so it's easy for me to know the products that work for me even without trying just I mean it still doesn't mean I won't part test yeah I would still part test for like um, say 10 minutes and see what comes out of it but black is an organic soap so it's not it doesn't seem to it doesn't seem to be something i should be worried about uh, so i got the black soap and then i got the cerave pm uh, cleanser and then i got this lip balm it's a lip mask um i have used it before 
and it worked for me but i didn't remember the name and i couldn't find the bottle anymore so i kind of just used some other random lip thing after and it didn't work for me so seeing it again it was so nice to see and uh what else did i get what else did I oh i got my vitamin c serum by utopia uh yeah those are the four things i got so forgive me for not doing the video but I, I i mean yeah i just thought i was going to explain and just I, I thought i was just going to talk about it so right now i want to uh i have some photocopies to make so i'm heading to my friend's office to make those photocopies and then i already have a power bank but i want to get an extra power bank i don't know when i might need it and um it's better to have two than have one <laughs> that you don't know if it will last at all, right? All right, so. um so i'm done checking in i'm done with immigration your girl is tired like i'm crazily tired but i'm glad i got to the i got to the airport like an hour before uh the end of my boarding whatever like i literally got to the airport around 7 30 something and boarding was going to close at 8 something there was mad traffic for like three hours but I'm glad I was able to wrap things up on time. I'm going to locate my gates right now. Um, and I don't know, maybe once I locate the gates, I can always find something to drink. I'm more thirsty than hungry. Um, my flight is still in another two hours. So maybe settle down, watch a movie, press my phone or something. I'll just find something to do.
so um, we bought it already and I honestly can't wait to eat and just sleep. Uh, the flight is a four hour flight so I shall be where I'm going in the next, in the next uh, seven hours thereabouts. So I'll, I'll get there by morning. Remember that I said I have a stopover fest so I'll be stopping over fest in a particular country like that. I still want you guys to guess and um, yeah, I, I think this is the end of this vlog. This is the end of this vlog, and um, I still have a vlog to make at my stopover. I have a vlog to make as well at my final destination. So, if you enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like, and also to comment. All right, guys.